Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a new in haul. This is kind of like autumn slash winter, um, but it's the stuff that I've been buying recently and I thought I'd gather it all together and show you guys. I haven't been shopping in one particular shop recently. I've kind of been dabbing my toes into all of the brands and I've got a bit from Topshop, I've got a bit from H&M, Mango, are kept so it's a bit of like here and there but it's me trying to put together my autumn capsule wardrobe so yeah let's get into it and i'll show you what i bought i'm gonna start with the good stuff first and i did place a mango order online every time i go into the mango store i don't really find anything that i like but when i'm online i see everything that i like so i tend to prefer to order online when it comes to mango other shops like H&M and Topshop, I actually prefer to shop in store. So yeah, let's crack open this box and see what I got. First up, I got these earrings. These are really statement and oversized. These were $12.99. If you've been watching my vlogs recently, then you've probably seen me wear these. But it's a really nice way to dress up a casual outfit. It just gives something to the outfit and it makes it look a little bit more glam and classy. Mango earrings are so on point this season honestly there's so many pairs of earrings that I want from Mango and I'm probably gonna place another order and get some more earrings I don't feel like I need any more clothes maybe a couple of more coats and a couple of more jumpers and a pair of good solid black boots but other than that I think I'm pretty much done for autumn winter so first up I bought a shirt I actually saw this in store but they didn't have my size so I ordered it online I'm all over white shirts um, recently I love white shirts um, but this one's a little bit different it's got black polka dots on but it's not like a polka dot print fabric these polka dots have actually been um, it's embroidery so it gives a little bit of texture to the shirt and it just makes it look a little bit more nicer this is the shirt on as you can see it's quite a casual shirt I've just rolled up the sleeves because that is how I would wear it unless I'm wearing it underneath a jumper or something and it's such a classy smart but casual shirt and I love the fabric it's different to the classic white shirt fabric it's more of a cottony fabric it's definitely more of a daytime shirt but I guess this is the kind of shirt that you could wear to work as well so it's really versatile and I really like it and these pockets just make it look extra casual and more daytime appropriate and this shirt actually comes in a lot of different colors and prints so I'm sure there's something for everyone there's like a striped one there's a burgundy polka dot one but I went for the white one because I thought I would get more wear out of it because it's more of a classic style and yeah I really like this shirt next is a pair of boots that I bought last month and I've been wearing them to death you've probably seen me wear them all the time on Instagram and I always have them on in my vlogs they these mango booties it's just the perfect heel height it's not too high it's not too low it's perfect for daytime wear and I love how pointy they are it's just a really nice pair of boots and I like that it's low as well so it's not high it doesn't cut me off at my calves and make my calves look chunkier than they are which I find happens with a lot of winter boots they're just such a nice classic pair of boots like you can't go wrong with this style of boot it just goes with jeans it goes with trousers it goes with skirts it just oh and the best thing about these were it was 35 pounds I think uh, 35 or 36 pounds so they were really inexpensive but they look really expensive like I can imagine like Kurt Geiger or June doing a pair of these for like 90 or 100 pounds so they're definitely a good staple piece for the autumn winter wardrobe next up I bought these smart black trousers from Mango these are really comfy because they've got a lot of stretch in there and they're really nice and fitted on the leg area and it's actually a really nice length for me normally trousers like this would be too long but this isn't too bad and even if I fold it up that looks nice as well so I could do that as well and have them more casual but these black trousers are a staple I would say I don't have any black trousers like this in my collection so next up I have this blazer it's a classic 
green and navy check and when I saw this online I was just like oh my god that is so me I really need it and the thing about mango blazers are this was I think £70 which is kind of not a lot for a blazer but it is kind of for a high street blazer but what I like about mango blazers are they fit really well the tailoring is good for the price sometimes um, something like H&M, I wouldn't buy a blazer in H&M just because I find that the cutting and the fit in H&M blazers are not that great. So when it comes to blazers, I always head to Mango or I head to Next because um, those two shops do really good fits and cuttings. And this is kind of like a casual blazer. I could wear this over a chunky knit or shirt like this. Probably not these trousers, I would swap it out for a pair of jeans or something just so it's a little bit more casual because this is feeling very smart right now because I've got like smart black trousers on, a shirt and then a blazer but you get what I mean when I say I would swap it out for a pair of jeans. Next up I bought a couple of jumpers, this one is from Arquette. I actually got this in the sale when they were doing a sale about two weeks ago, two three weeks ago. Um, it was originally about 70 or 65 pounds. I got it in the sale for, I think it, they were doing it for like 39 pounds and then when you went to pay there was an extra 15% off so I got it for about 35 pounds I, I believe. But it's such a nice classic jumper. You cannot go wrong with a stripy basic jumper in your wardrobe and for autumn, winter, I think I'm going to be wearing this a lot. It's such a comfy fabric as well and Arquette is a little bit more pricey so the fabric and the quality is a lot better than say your average high street store so I can imagine this jumper is going to last me for years and years and I've just paired it with some blue washed jeans which is how I would wear it I guess and yeah I like this it just feels really nice and comfy and cosy and warm on the skin and it's not itchy at all it just feels it feels kind of sil silky. Next jumper is this one. This is a really basic standard jumper that I got from H&M about two weeks ago. I actually wore this to go pumpkin picking so you've probably seen this on my Instagram already but it's a really nice gorgeous brown colour and that is what drew me to it is the colour but actually it's really comfy and it's really warm and the best thing about this is it was $17.99 the thing about H&M jumpers are they do amazing styles, amazing colours but they do not last very long so a lot of my H&M jumpers that I bought last year, um, last winter probably are not great looking now so <laughs> that's why I'm trying to invest more into my clothing so that it lasts a little bit longer but when I saw this in H&M I just couldn't not buy it because you know it's a nice colour, it's a nice fit, it was $17.99 it's a basic kind of like throw on jumper, easy to style and I was just like yeah and I'm really happy that I got it they do it in a lot of different colours so you can choose a different colour if you want like grey or black but I went for this brown colour because it's very autumnal so moving on to jeans, I've got two pair of blue jeans. I'm not really a big blue jean wearer but I think I've been converted for this autumn winter because I'm a bit tired of wearing black jeans all the time. So I've got some blue ones, these are from Gap. Honestly guys, Gap do the best sales ever. Every single morning I wake up to a Gap newsletter saying that it's 40% off, 30% off or extra 20% off the sale. I got these for about £25 and they're such an amazing deal because they fit like a glove. I wear a size 25 or, or a 26, um, it depends on the jean style but these are a 25 and I just love them so much, they're a little bit cropped so they're good for wearing with booties like this it just looks really nice and I don't know, I just love the thread hem I love the length, I love the way it looks, I love the style and they're like proper, proper jeans they're not like thin, stretchy kind of jegging jeans these are like proper jeans and I really like them such a bargain, if you haven't checked out Gap jeans ever then do so honestly you will not be disappointed these are another pair of gap jeans that i got 
and um, you'll not believe it guys I got these for £12 they were in the sale for I think £14.99 or £15 and then they were doing an extra 20% off so I got these for £12 freaking pounds. honestly guys these are from Gap they're similar to the ones that I just tried on but these have got like rips and a bit of kind of like detail to them and again it's a raw hem I'm really liking the raw hem look on jeans right now and I think these are just a little bit too long for me so I might just cut them off and create my own raw hem um, I think another kind of like two centimeters would make them absolutely perfect definitely a blue jeans confet this autumn winter I'm I'm just all over it I've got two things from Topshop one is a blazer and one is a coat that I wanted to show you guys this blazer I picked up in the sale is a navy and white striped blazer I actually saw this during the summer it's part of the summer collection and it went in the sale um, as soon as autumn hit and I'm so glad that I didn't get it in summer because it was £75 and I got it in a sale for £35 and then when I went to pay there was an extra 20% off so that was £7 off so it made it £28 and yeah it's really tight right now because I've got this big chunky jumper on but as you can see it's a really nice classic blazer and it's quite a casual style as well let me take you guys down um, yeah so as you can see classic everyday kind of blazer I wouldn't wear it with this chunky jumper because it's making the arms look really tight but you guys get the gist it's a nice blazer and I don't have anything like this in my collection and this other a plain grey black or white t-shirt would just look I like it a lot next thing I got from Topshop was this green coat I've been wearing it a lot and it's all over my Instagram and a lot of you guys ask me so many questions every single day on Instagram about the length, about the fit, about the colour so I thought I'd just try it on in this haul and show you guys I've actually had it for about a month now and it's a really nice relaxed long casual oversized coat it's a size 6, it's a little bit big so I would size down one size and it's a really nice forest green colour have nothing like this in my collection and they do a really nice camel colour as well and I was actually thinking of getting the camel colour too but then I was like actually I should get another style of coat like instead of getting the same coat in a different colour so I'm on the hunt for a nice black coat and a camel coloured coat so yeah, lovely, lovely coat and I think it's on offer right now in Topshop. I got it for £65 and they were doing a student discount, 20% off, so my friend got it for me. So I got this for about 50, 50 something pounds, but right now I think they're doing it for even less because they're doing 30% off, so it's even cheaper and it's such a nice throw on coat and Underneath the lapels, there's this pink felt detailing, which I find really nice. It's actually stunning. I really like it. Um, it just gives the coat a little bit of something, and it's got pockets. It's relaxed. It's warm. It's a really good price, and yeah, highly, highly recommend this. So Nasty Girl was doing an amazing deal. They were doing 50% off the entire website the entire website so I went on there and I saw so many things that I liked there's actually a couple of things that I've already sent back because when it came out I was just like like no it looked really tacky and it didn't suit me so I've already sent that back before I forget and the things that I did keep I'm going to show you guys because it's really worth showing and if it's still on half price then it's a really good deal um, I'm not sure if it is but I'll find out for you guys and I'll link everything down below in the information box anyways so yeah I'm like if I'm gonna buy stuff from Nasty Girl it's definitely not gonna be long lasting quality pieces it's more fast fashion so it's more like the trend pieces so the three items that I went for are very trend focused because they're all leopard print because I know that come summer I'm probably not gonna be wearing leopard print as much as I'm gonna be wearing in autumn winter 
So I've got three leopard print things. This one is a dress. It's gorgeous, gorgeous. I got it for half price, which worked out to be about £15. So a really good, good deal. And I really like the neckline as well. It comes down quite low. And then the back is like that. This is the dress on. And oh my God, I love it so much. It is so flattering. It just skims in all the right places and is a really nice thing fit. I like how loose it is here and then slimming it is here and all of these like little details are really nice. The only thing is it's a wrapper for dress so if you plan to wear this on its own then definitely wear some kind of like shorts underneath because one gush of wind and you're revealing everything to everyone and I would probably wear this with some kind of tights and also a short kind of like boy style shorts um, just to cover my modesty or else you might be f flashing like no one wants that and I also got a leopard print denim skirt this worked out to be about £10 which I thought wasn't bad just for a little trend piece to update my wardrobe it's leopard print and it's a denim skirt. This is the leopard print skirt. As you can see, it's really basic and it's really um, casual and nice. And I would probably wear it like this with a plain black t-shirt. And I would probably wear tights as well because it's getting really cold outside. So tights and a pair of boots and a oversized coat or something. Yeah, that would look really nice. But for 10 pounds, I really can't complain. And last but not least, I got a vest. I already have one similar, but it's a lot lighter in colour. It's a H&M one that I always wear. So I got a darker one. And this is a different fabric. It's more like a silky kind of fabric. It does feel a little bit cheap but I got it for £7.50 so for £7.50 you really can't complain about the fabric and the quality. This is the leopard print top. I obviously don't have the white brown right now. I would probably wear a strapless bra but as you can see it's just a basic leopard print vest top with really nice lace detailing on here and I think a chunky cardigan on top would make it look really really nice. That comes to the end of my autumn new in haul if you liked any of these items let me know or if you didn't like them let me know and i'll list all the items in the information box as always and yeah i'm really happy with this haul actually i think it's one of my most favorite hauls i've done in a while because i feel like everything that i bought i like so yeah hope you enjoyed it too and i'll see you in my next video bye guys Mwah.